getting on to uh, our best players today. Um, our fourth best award has gone to uh, a young player who probably had what I thought and spoke to him last week, a disappointing game last week in more particularly the way he went about his business as a defender. I thought today he had a pretty tough tough role playing on the uh, the premier premier full forward in the competition over the past few years and I thought defensively he did extremely well. The ball did come into him particularly well on a number of occasions which was difficult to defend but generally I thought he really tried his guts out and did a pretty good job and that was Luke Sandy. First of all, I'd just like to um, congratulate Hangers on the games. Well done, mate. Uh, good win for the Reds today, and uh, hopefully they go on to new and better things. Um, thanks to all the supporters for coming out. Um, hope to see you back to the finals. Cheers. Our third best award has gone to a player, um, hey, as, I mentioned, as I mentioned to you earlier, I, uh, I love these type of players that just really play with, with enormous courage, determination, desire. Um, he tries his guts out. Been unfortunate the last couple of years he's carried a, a fairly major injury which uh, even the great players take a fair while to get over. He's just starting to, to really get back into into not, not so much rare form but get back into a position where he can play at his best but just his inspiration and the way he goes about his work and he's one of our captains and I thought he was one of the few forwards today that really uh, really gave us what we needed up front and uh, uh, his game was terrific today and that was um, Michael Swan. <laughs> Uh, congratulations, Hangers, on your 100 games. Marvellous achievement um, and really well deserved. Congratulations to the reserves. Um, you know, it's a really good effort to make finals football and uh, make sure you take the opportunity when it comes. It's, uh, I kind of remember uh, last time reserves made finals footy in this club, but it uh, hasn't been in my time. So, uh, to the league boys, um, make sure we're preparing as if we're playing in two weeks um, and you know, we'll come out and smash it down. Thanks. Probably a dig of our, uh, our top three players today uh, are those type of players that I've mentioned to you uh, before, and you know what I've mentioned about Michael. And this guy had a had a it was amazing when I uh, saw him go down last week. I think everybody uh, sort of packed the bags and said, "Oh well, that's it. He won't play again this year." But I never ever doubted him. I uh, just his makeup, his character. I always knew that he get himself up, and not only did he get himself up, but he. Uh, he gave us a, a terrific contribution again today, Craig Wolf. <laughs> First of all, I'd just like to thank everyone for coming back today and supporting uh, all three grades and hanging around. Uh, well done to Michael Braun on his efforts with the Colts this year. Uh, well done to the twos. Make sure you do everything right this week. Um, prepare well and you know, who knows what can happen from here. To our guys, um, let's just look forward to playing in two weeks in Bassin Thank you. Thank you. Our, uh, our best player today, um, three times I think, three time Premiership player, and he's been uh, he's been an enormous player for this footy club. And uh, every time he steps out, our players uh, that surround him really need to take a leaf out of his book. Because the one thing that that you can never ever question about this guy is that whenever it really counts, he always stands up, and that's probably why he's such a highly decorated decorated player as he is. And that, that's Brent Cow. Uh, look, uh, first of all, just want to congratulate uh, Hangers. Uh, been around a while now, Hangers, so see you get 100, mate. It's great effort. Uh, the twos boys, well done on cementing uh, the spot in the finals. Uh, good effort. Um, 
So our boys are obviously pretty disappointing today, but uh, no, Clem won't have done us a favour. So uh, we're all going to have to get up and journal up next week and uh, go for the uh, neighbours. So we'll see you all again in two weeks, eh? Off, we did, I'd just like to say congratulations to Angus, a terrific effort to get the 100 games and uh, just to understand how important a player you are to this player group. And finally, uh, you the supporters for sticking in. Um, the one thing I love about this footy club, I mentioned many, many times about the tradition and just to see last week with the reunion that we had and again today, to see the way that you come back and support this footy club, to see the way you support our player group. Um, just the encouragement to give them on game day and I think it's massive when uh, when we hear your support from the stands and so on and I reckon you know let's stand up and shout and let's roar even more so and hopefully we get another chance to, to give you a chance to do that because it really really is important to us and the players it's magnificent the way you do stick by us and support us it's uh, absolutely fantastic and I'm sure the players will return you in good stead with uh, with success on the footy field. I thank you again and I hope you stand by us. Thank you. Thanks, Coach.